Okay, we're going to go ahead and write our first uh, Hello World program uh, in Java. And when we're first starting learning, we're going to use uh, a simple notepad. Uh, we all have downloaded Notepad++. So go ahead and open up Notepad++. And one thing you guys should know is that Java is very case sensitive. So when I type a capital case letter, you type a capital case letter. If I don't type a capital letter, don't type it. Uh, you'll find very quickly it is very, very touchy. Uh, so as you can see, when we can start writing Java, uh, we're not getting any of our uh, IDE features letting us know that these are keywords. Um, so right away, I'm going to save this document, file, save as. I'm going to click on my desktop, make sure it's on my desktop. And I'm going to put quotes around my file name. So notice the first character I type was a quotation mark. And I'm going to type hello world.java end quote. Now what this will do is it will prevent the .txt from appending to our .java file. Now if I click on save, again, caps is important, capital H, capital W. Click on save. Notice we get a little bit of um, IDE help letting us know that these are keywords. And what we're doing here is we are naming our class, hello world, and then opening and closing curly braces. Now, in Notepad++, you see here that there's a red floppy diskette. It lets you know it hasn't been saved. If you press Control s it'll turn blue. You save your file. So you'll see me pressing Control s throughout this. I always like to save as I go. Uh, so what we've done so far is we've made a class called Hello World. Essentially, we've made a, we've made a program called Hello World. We're going to probably not understand all of the keywords today. Um, but for right now, just understand, we've made a program called Hello World. And the first method we're going to write is called the main method. The main method is where your Java program starts. We're going to write a lot of methods. We're going to write a lot of classes. But it's important to understand the main method is always where the, the uh, JVM starts running your program. So the main method looks like this public static void main string args. You guys probably don't understand what a single one of those words means. Right now, just understand as a whole, this line of code, line three, tells the JVM to start running your program at this line. Notice there's a capital S, followed by brackets. Again, any typo here, your program's probably not going to run. Now, to get output to the screen, we understand we have a program named Hello World. It starts right here at the main method. To get output to the screen, we do a system dot out dot print line. We're going to say hello world. Hello world is very typically uh, the first program you do in any programming language. Whether you're writing C++, C Sharp, Java, Perl, Ruby, it's very common just to do a simple hello world program just so you can get the basics. Well, so, yeah, what is it going to do is it will say hello world at the command prompt. So if I go to my desktop, if I minimize this here, I see I have a hello world.java file. Here's mine look a little different than mine. 
Well, I'm going to go back into the command prompt. We said we're running our programs out of the command prompt. CMD and press enter. Now, it's important to understand the path of where the command prompt is at right now. I'm in my user profiles directory. I'll teach you guys a couple command prompt commands. If you hit DIR, it'll show you all the directories and all the files that are in my user profiles directory. Well, notice here there is a desktop directory. Well, if I change to the desktop directory, that's where this file is located that we just typed, the Java file. So watch what happens if I type CD stands for change directory. And if I just start typing desktop, for example, DE, and I hit tab, it'll auto fill the directory name for me. And I hit enter. Notice now I'm in the desktop directory. If I type in DIR again, I see the only thing I have is my hello world.java program file. Now to compile this, what did we use to compile our Java programs? Java C. Java C is the name of our compiler. And you have to type this exactly. Hello. Matter of fact, I can hit tab and it'll autofill for me. Hello world.java. If I hit enter. Now if it goes back to the command prompt, notice here and there's nothing reported, I know that I typed it without any errors. I got lucky. <laughs> In other words. Now if I take a look back on my desktop, there's that hello world dot class that we talked about. Now how do we run that class file? Java. Java.exe. Now notice here, I'm going to type in hello world. But to run this from the command prompt, you do not put any extension on it. You do not type the dot class. Watch what happens if I type the dot class. It gives me an error. That's bad. Obviously, we want to type Java, hello world. And there's our output. It says hello world to the screen. 